हेलो एवरी वन आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू माई अनादर वीडियो सेशन वेयर इन वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग हाउ टू एक्सट्रैक्ट और गेट द टोटल नंबर ऑफ रोज फ्रॉम द डाटा टेबल यूजिंग ए ट्वेंटी नाइनटीन ऑटोमेशन एनी वेयर सो बिफोर वी स्टार्ट आर सेशन फॉर टूडे आई रिक्वेस्ट एवरी वन ऑफ यू टू प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल एंड हिट द नोटिफिकेशन आइकन so that you receive all the latest updates and notifications that we keep posting on our youtube channel so without any further delay let us start our discussion for the day so first of all drag and drop the open action from the excel advanced package so in the properties section select the desktop file path or the path of the excel file where it is located on your system so if it is located on your system then select the desktop file type desktop file tab and then browse for the file from your location computer location and then once you have selected the file then click on the sheet contains a header checkbox and then scroll down at the bottom and then create excel session uh, select the local session and pass in the session name as per your requirement or as per your choice then we will use the get multiple cell action to uh, get all the rows from the excel so select the range uh, so drag and drop the get multiple cells action from the excel advanced package and from the properties section select the range of cells to be returned so select all rows and then in the read option select the read visible text in cell and then in the session name pass in the session name that we have used in the open action and then assign the value to the data table variable so we have uh, taken the by default variable name that comes when we click on this create variable button so uh, we have stored the contents of the cell uh, in the excel sheet data table variable now to get the total number of rows from the data table so from the data table command drag and drop the get number of rows of uh, action and then in the property section select the data table name that is the excel sheet data and then uh, in the uh, uh, there are two there are two radio buttons and by default select total rows uh, option is selected so if you want to get the total number of rows so then you need to select this option and if you want to get the non empty rows then uh, select the uh, radio button that is select non empty rows and assign the output to a number variable so we have created a variable called v row count and then drag and drop the message box command to print the output of this get number of rows action so in the enter the message to display field in the properties section select the v row count variable and convert this number variable to a string variable over here that is in line conversion and then finally close the excel advanced uh, and then finally close the excel so pass in the same session name that we used in the open action so now we will run the bot to see the output of this uh, bot that is what output or what total number of rows that we get so once you click on the run button the bot will be deployed on the system on your, on which you are running the bot and the bot agent service would be invoked so now you can see the bot is now opening the excel file and now it has printed the total number of rows that is there are total 3 rows in the excel file so as you can see over here in the excel file there are total 3 rows of data in the excel so it uh, so the output of for total number of rows has come as 3 so the bot has run successfully with that we have come to the end of our video session 
so in today's video we saw how to get the total number of rows from the data table using a2019 automation anywhere if you have any queries regarding the video or the content then you can raise your queries in the comment section and i will be more than happy to answer all of your queries so before we wind up for the day i request every one of you to please subscribe to my youtube channel and hit the notification icon so that you receive all the latest updates and notifications that we keep posting on our youtube channel thank you all and have a great day